revolution is knocking on Gotham's door. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we will change Gotham. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? Your father knew which hands to shake. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. This is Selena. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Falcone's calling card. The chemicals. Where are they? We're all being played in, couldn't you? Gangsters in Gotham! <laughs> well, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, and everything in between to Batman, the Telltale series. You just saw what happened previously on Batman, so I don't have to tell you. <laughs> Great. And now we're back in episode two. I believe it's called Children of Arkham. We'll find out. It will pop up on the screen the series adapts it does it adapt I mean the ending is pretty much going to be the same regardless that's how every Telltale game works I thought I might find you here. The news was upsetting for both of us, but you should see this. I know you come here for solitude, Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. People are throwing stones at my family, Alfred. I need to understand why. It's my family, too. Don't forget that. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I, I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money taints you. My money has never corrupted me. And I'm proud of you. But you're hardly the norm. Hill greased the wheels of politics. Falcone was the muscle. Thomas legitimized the whole enterprise with his name. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone, they were partners. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing. Falcone, the papers, they were telling the truth. Everyone knew about this but me. I know it's a lot to take in. I want you to know I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. But then they were killed, and you were all alone. And I just couldn't walk out the door. 
Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. How could I hold this against you? You're all I've got, Alfred. Thank you. I won't let you down again. This is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a low-life thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known. Rude. Too... too big. Yet, there it was. Wouldn't Chill just run when he recognized him? Well, it's a fair assumption. But he didn't. You always said it was a simple mugging. In 20 years, you've never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's wrong. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Well, we're gonna detective now, 20 years later. Okay. I want him standing here, right now. And what would the Batman do with his own parents' killer? The possibilities are frightening. I'd only want to ask him one question. Why? My parents could have given him anything. Why would he just shoot them? He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. Invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I always wanted to be brave. Just like him. And you are. He would be so proud to see that you took a different path. times at that theater. How long did it play there? Only when you wanted to see it, Bruce. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. I never knew that. She was always so good to me. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading, you don't have to do this. And the gun fires. And after that? Uh, there are considerable gaps in that recollection. Maybe. Do I really want to know? Like a lot. 
it out of him can you stop with the motorcycle I hope it doesn't my mic doesn't pick up on it my neighbor is messing around with his motorcycle great fucking timing jackass I hope you can hear that neighbors you in to see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. You owe me, Harvey, and now I need your help. Those are donations, not loans. You're not entitled to a pound of flesh. Hell, I'll settle for a handshake and a blind eye. The last time you disappeared behind closed doors with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support. Just I'm not him. sure, but I think Falcone put a hit on my parents. Wait, what? Bruce, that's... that's terrible. That's why I have to speak with him. I have to know for sure. Bruce, I appreciate you opening up to me, but just try and keep it cool in there. I don't want any headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Dent, Mr. Wayne. Welcome to the GCPD. Thank you, Lieutenant. Man, Ordinarily, we never high. let you in to see That's... Falcone, but I must be nice to have a DA in your Old pocket, age. Mr. Wayne. Bend the rules whenever you need it. One hand washes the other, Lieutenant. That's not I press. Is that how it works? Of course. Otherwise, everyone has dirty hands. What he means is. We'll repay the favor in kind. I'm gonna call you on that. Nice job bringing in Falcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thanks, Sergeant. We're keeping Falcone in the infirmary. I don't know what just happened. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. I Whoever he is behind the mask, Batman's a hero to me. Yeah, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. All right, Falcone's inside. Just say what you gotta say. We'll be out here. All right, let's do this. Let's rough him up. Children of Arkham. There we go. The hell? Bruce Wayne? He didn't even look at me before he could smell me. That's it. You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. <laughs> Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> you look like you tangled with the wrong guy. <laughs> this is nothing. You should have seen me before I became boss. I'd show up all beat to hell. Your father had sewn me back together. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. 
More like cousins. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. Hey, I tried to get through to your dense party. Maybe I should have spelled it out. Got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. Watch it, Falcone. I still see some unbroken bones. <laughs> Tough guy, eh? I bet you came to kick some answers out of me, huh? Your father, Hill, and me. We ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and help Uncle Carmine out, huh? Oh, can we kill him? No, wait, we can't. We're bad now. I am not here to take care of you. You deserve to suffer for what you've done. Of course. Don't kill him. You never know the truth. How much of your old man is in you? What kind of son did he make? <laughs> I'm no murderer, Falcone. Unlike you. <sighs> yeah. That's why you were kept in the dark. He loved you, you know. He did it all for you. He protected his own. And if you got on his bad side, your father was more ruthless than any of us. He had a switch, you know. Still, made us all rich, including you. Some people just have the mind for it. He was one of the most brilliant men I ever knew. Until you hired an assassin to take him out. What, you really think I ordered the hit? Sure, I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that to heart. Oh, shit. They're waiting for you in hell! What's wrong with her mouth? The bastard had to die. Hands in the air! Stand down! Oh. Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Well, he's dead. Go! So... Go! Didn't see that coming. Alright guys, I'm gonna end this here. Like I said, I didn't see that coming. I didn't think that he would get shot. Um... But the plot thickens. They did take a lot of liberties. I mean, they changed a lot, which is fine. I mean, comics do it all the time. They change shit up and, you know, we'll see if it works out in the end. That's what it's really all about, right? So, but so far, I'm still enjoying it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe for more. I'm Jay, and I will see you another day. And I hope this fucking motorcycle doesn't fucking... Mm. Haha. <laughs>